Hey guys, this is Tony W, and we're gonna do a quick review of this Flag Power keyboard and mouse combo. This is a lit gaming keyboard that I'm using so I could work at night when I do my video edits. This is a pretty good option. I got myself a Flag Power um, gaming keyboard and mouse combo, and it is wired, and it goes to my USB uh, 3 hub that goes into my gaming laptop, which I use as a video editor. Now this gaming laptop is an MSI GE 75 Raider, and it has a Steel Series beautiful um, keyboard, 10 key, as well as a big tracking pad. But I prefer a mouse, so I use my Logitech mouse. But I also want keys that were raised, so it's easier to type on. So this is actually pretty neat. That's why I bought this, and it's just fairly inexpensive. So that's why it's it's you know it matches, except there's no programmable keys for the color and individual keys. So let me show you what I mean by that. Um, so let's say I turn off the lights and stuff, or let's turn it lower to the lights. So it's nice and bright, so I could see it at night when I'm uh, editing my videos and stuff. So it's, as you can see, it's quite bright. And there's also different functions, but the functions are quite limited uh, for this. So if I hit down the function key and hit this, I could actually change the color combinations, but you can't have a single color. So it's pretty limited on that. So there's only three, I think it was like one, two, three. Yeah, three color combinations for different, you know, rainbow effect colors. And then you can also switch it to different breathing effects too. So you could turn it on and starts breathing. It goes dims on and dims off. So you guys should turn up the light or turn off the light. So you could turn off the lights by hitting this function and then this uh, down button, down key, as well as the upward key to turn one light and then brighter and then brightest. I guess there's only one way. Anyways, unlike my other one, this, I, it's programmable. This is the SteelSeries um, keyboard. And I have it laid out for Adobe Premiere. So for the in and out and you know, the controls and stuff for video editing. That's what I like about programmable LED lights and keyboards. So this is not programmable at all, but I didn't really need it to. This is for typing and stuff. So it makes my life easier. My hands feel better to just type regular stuff. But if I was gonna do editing, I just I bring my laptop up with me, and as well as a uh, my my USB mouse, and it's a okay. So as you can see, it came with a combo mouse. This combo mouse also has like uh, lighting on lighting effects on it, and it looks pretty cool. So cool wise, yes. Um, functional wise, this feels great. It's a keyboard, and this mouse works fine too. It could go up to I think um, I think thirty two hundred DPI. Let's take a quick look, anyways. Let's turn the lights back on. But yeah, overall, I like it, and it's very inexpensive. So if you're on the fence on getting this thing, it works. The keys feel great, and it feels almost me mechanical. Um, but these are actually mechanical keys, which is cool. So any other features on it? Uh, let's take a quick look, real fast. I just unbox this thing real quick. It's in German, but let's go to the English side. So here's a quick look at the instruction manual. It has the different function function keys that you could press, like the media keys and stuff, as well as the function keys for increasing brightness and permanent light mode, also decreasing brightness and breathing mode. So that's pretty cool. And also changing the colors of it. So in terms of, it's basically a three color rainbow backlit keyboard and three grades of brightness, standard, you know, 104 keys, and 19 non-conflict keys. In other words, it's good for gaming. And a gaming mouse, which has six colors of breathing light, you know, and also 1200 DPI native, which is neat. Um, there you go for the other function keys and stuff. And other features is plug and play, no drivers needed, works with most of those OSs, and I skip waterproof. And, you know, it's the non-slip design, pretty cool. But that's about it. So this is the Flag Power R7000 gaming keyboard. Came in that box, not much else other than just packaging material inside. But yeah, that's really about it. Overall, I like it. It's a nice full-size keyboard and it's lit so I can actually see the keys when I'm working in a near dark room when I'm editing at night. Anyways, that's it guys. And I hope you enjoyed this video. This is Stone and Debbie and I hope this was helpful to you. So thanks for watching guys and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Anyways, if you haven't already, please like, subscribe, hit the bell button for the Sony W channel. I do a lot of Costco runs, price checking, as well as new product finds. Anyways, there's also a lot of long-term reviews and updates, as well as other fun current reviews and stuff. 
as well as DIYs and how-to videos. So check out the channel and have fun. See you next time. Bye-bye.